Hello, welcome to the USWNT News Channel. It's a pleasure to have you here. And if you're new, make sure to subscribe to the channel to stay updated on everything happening with the US Women's National Team. Let's get to the latest news. The US Women's National Team will certainly feel the absence of Mallory Swanson in the upcoming World Cup this summer. How could they not? At the time of her injury, there were few players in the world in better form than Swanson, who seemed poised to make her tournament debut. But on a day when the USWNT attack faltered once again, the potential replacement for Swanson stepped up and made a dominant case for herself. Trinity Rodman scored both goals in the USWNT's 2-0 victory over Wales, a game that was certainly less than ideal for a team heading into the World Cup this week. It was a tough encounter with several hard fouls, and the US looked like a team still building chemistry, not one whose next match would be the World Cup opener. Are you enjoying the news? Leave a like to support the channel. It motivates me to keep bringing you the latest news about the USWNT. Thank you very much. Rodman made life a little better with her win, which came from a perfect cross by Sophia Smith. It was a standout performance from the Washington Spirit star, who actually came off the bench to play in the center, despite primarily operating on the wing. Her second goal, however, was the better of the two, with Rodman hitting a shot from inside the box to seal the 2-0 victory. Starting on the left was teenager Alyssa Thompson, and during her time on the field, the rising star was the most dynamic forward for the USWNT. Not everything she attempted worked out, but she certainly showed a lot of promise in what was a strong display. Now, Vlatko Andonovsky has a lot to figure out. Does he go with Rodman or Thompson in the attack? How does he get more out of the offense than we saw against Wales? And how, in this cycle, nearing its end, does he align a team that still seems to have a lot to discover? USWNT fans, what's your opinion on this? Write in the comments below and let us know what you thought of this last game, before the World Cup. See you in the next news update.